In just a few moments, we'll be pasting text into InDesign. But first, we need to actually copy some text from somewhere. So I happen to be in another program just here. Which program? Doesn't matter. All that matters is that this text is clearly formatted. So I'm going to press Command or Control A to select all of that text. And let's now go up to Edit, Copy. So I've just now copied the text to the clipboard. Let's now jump into InDesign. And I've set up a few text boxes ahead of time just here. So I'll get my cursor inside the first one. And let's go up to the Edit menu and come down to Paste. Now this is great, InDesign's happily pasted that text in, but clearly it's also removed any of the formatting. Now this isn't necessarily a bad thing. Actually, you'll often want to strip out the formatting when you bring text into InDesign, just to make sure nothing weird is creeping into your design in terms of formatting. But what happens if you actually do want to bring in the formatting? How could we possibly do that? Well, let me get my cursor inside of my second text box just here. Let's go up to the Edit menu. Now, this is kind of interesting, right? The Paste command that we just used actually strips out the formatting. But there is an option just here called Paste Without Formatting, which is currently grayed out. It isn't even available to us. What's going on just here? Well, I'd like to point out a very important preference setting just now. So here on a Mac, up under InDesign, Preferences, Clipboard Handling. On a Windows machine, you'll find this at the bottom of the Edit menu. So when we jump into Clipboard Handling, there's a section just here when pasting text and tables from other applications. Now what's interesting to note here is that text only is the default setting. Let's now activate the other option, all information. So I'm going to choose OK. Now again, my cursor is flashing inside of my second text box just here. Let's go up to the edit menu and check this out. Not only is paste still available, but paste without formatting is now available to us. So let's actually choose paste again. Remember, the first time we used this, it stripped out the formatting. So if I choose edit paste just now, check this out. It's actually now brought in the formatting of our text. So let's click inside of that third text box just down here and go up to edit, paste without formatting. So this is our first time using this option. And when I choose it, sure enough, we get text that has had the formatting stripped away from it. And which of course looks identical to what we got the first time we pasted text in here. So just to sum up here guys, if you're pasting text into InDesign, whether you do or don't want that formatting, you'll do so via the edit option and you'll be using paste or paste without formatting. And remember, if paste without formatting isn't available to you, jump into your preferences, clipboard handling, and have a look at these options just here. So I hope that helps. Catch you later.